everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. Before I begin guys, I want to let you know I am not giving you any medical advice. I'm not making any medical claims. And with that being said, let's go ahead and move forward. So, the, the story that I want to share with you guys today is actually, I've had some interesting people contact me recently, basically doctors and scientists, who are, gonna, who are already have been doing a ton of research in regards to deuterium hydrogen. And an interesting theory that I've had for quite a number of years, somehow one of their doctor scientists came up with basically the same theory. And it's mostly on data. That's how I come up with most of my theories. And they need to do some research and studies on how molecular hydrogen affects deuterium hydrogen on the body and of course how, how that would affect overall health. And the reason that I'm making the video is because what device did they choose to use in their scientific research and studies? Now you have to understand, they're gonna wanna pick the best there is. They're not gonna wanna pick some garbage device. In fact, they even looked into HHO devices, Brown's gas, and for they basically are not gonna use that. Uh, not only is there virtually no data on it, the way that it's being made using chemicals like light, they're like, this is not the route we wanna go. They wanna follow the science, they want to follow, they want to use the best that there is in order to follow, again, the proper science and do a really good scientific study. And they're actually going to use the Hydrofix, which is literally the same device that I'm using. And I think this tells you something. We're talking about people who are, whether they're scientists, doctors, you know, intellectuals, people who are highly intelligent and understand the world of science. And this is a device that they're choosing. I think that says a lot. And so I just wanted to share this video with you guys because if you're interested, comment below. Let me know that you want more information on this because I'm going to be able to bring you guys data that literally the world hasn't seen yet. And to me, this is a really, really big deal. And we're about to find out if some of the theories that I have and some of the theories that, you know, some of these other people have, if it really, really works in the sense of using molecular hydrogen in the body to literally have what I would call positive effects on the deuterium, like basically trying to get this deuterium out of the body or maybe even somehow regulated in some way like the free radical damage and whatnot or oxidative stress. And we're about to see what this can do. It's gonna take a while, but I wanted to share this with you guys, my viewers, because I really think that you guys are gonna enjoy this. Again, don't forget to share, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to support the channel as this really helps so that I can continue to, continue to bring this really great information to you guys. And with that being said, that's it guys. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time. Stay tuned and I'll see you next time on the next video.